Have you heard about this new AI tool that your favorite content creators are using to make cinematic viral videos for their faceless YouTube channel, movies, TV shows, and other creative projects? The tool does everything for you from writing your script to creating voiceovers, making amazing visuals and editing the entire video all on one platform even if you don't have any camera microphone or you don't have any editing skills this tool helps you to make high quality professional videos from start to finish without you ever having to show your face on camera this is the same tool that top creators are using right now to get millions of views and build successful faceless youtube channels from scratch and in this video i'll I'll teach you how you can use it as well as a content creator or business owner to create full videos for your YouTube channel, for movies, or any kind of content that you want to make in just a few minutes using this powerful tool called Foco ML. Foco ML is an AI tool that helps you to create video content, TV shows, or whatever you want to make. It helps you with writing your script, making the videos, editing, adding music, sound effects, and so so much more all in one place i found foco recently and i was just really impressed by what it can do foco gives you access to some of the best ai models for video image and even voice creation like minimax cling luma runway imagen flux and 11 labs there's even a video editor built right inside of the website so once the agent finishes the video you can pretty much just keep editing it right there without needing to switch to other apps or using platforms like Adobe Premiere Pro or even CapCut. Focal is really powerful because it includes like the newest AI tools all in one place and makes it super easy to create amazing videos. To get started, visit focalml.com or click the link in my description. When you reach the homepage, you can either sign in or click the get started. If you've not already created an account before, just click get started to create one with your Google account or whatever you choose. It's pretty easy. As for me, I already have an account, so I just click on sign in and log in with my Google account. Once you've logged in or signed up, you'll be taken to this dashboard that is very simple and easy to use. To make your first project, just click on create new project or create project and it will take you to the next step. Once it opens, you'll see an AI chat box that looks a lot like other AI chat tools. To create a new project, you'll have three main options. Options. The first is that you can start from an idea. So you use this when you have an idea but you don't have a script or characters yet. Just type your idea into the chat and Focal will help you write the script and create the rest for you. For example, you can type something like create a documentary about the Pyramid of Giza and click generate. Second, you can start with a blank project. This is a good option if you want to build everything from scratch. The third option is you can start from a script. Choose this if you already have a script, a book or something you've already written out that you want to turn into a video in addition you can also click on narration to change the style of the voice in your video if you have a reference or a youtube video that you'd like to use as a reference just click template then paste the link of that video and the ai will try to copy the style of that youtube video and the structure of it as well also you can click on english and you can change the language to whatever you prefer I usually just leave mine in English since it's what I want my videos to be in. I honestly suggest or recommend you use the start from script option because it's just easier. When you click on it, it brings you to this page where you can literally type or paste your script. This works best when you already know what the video is all about or what you want to make and you already have a script ready. I already have a script so I just want to use this. So I'll just copy the script and paste it into the box on Focal. After pasting, click on continue and it might ask you what language you want to use. I'll keep mine in English, so I'll just leave it at that and then click continue again. Next, Focal will ask you to choose a visual style. This means how do you want your video to look? There are a bunch of styles to pick from. You can make it photorealistic, which pretty much looks like real people, real humans. And you can also go for the cartoon style, um, Pixar, Ghibli, infographics, and even whiteboard style as well. And you can also go 
for it the sketch style if you're making a video where you're explaining a concept then the sketch or infographic look might be really helpful it will draw things out for you as you talk so once you pick the style you want then scroll down to the next section and you're going to see something called aspect ratio this just means the shape or the size of your video for YouTube videos the best option is 16 by 9 so I'll just leave it at that but if you're making a video for shorts reels Instagram TikTok then you want to choose 9 by 16 instead the next section is the add subtitle section if you want your video to have captions then what you need to do here is choose standard but if you don't want to have any captions on your video then let it be there is also voice precision this pretty much just tells the AI how closely you want your voiceover to follow your script if you want your voiceovers to say the exact same thing that you wrote on your script then keep it on exact but if you feel like you want to change some words around then choose normal for me i want my voiceovers to sound exactly like the script so i'll keep it on exact now all you need to do is click create and focal is going to start generating your video for you it says here that it's going to take anything from 60 to 120 minutes to generate this video so just wait let it be just sit it out and yeah let the ai do its thing it's going to create the characters build the scenes and put everything together while you just sip on coffee or whatever you want and just wait for it to complete after a few minutes the scenes will be ready and your video will be ready now you can either download the video and post it right away or click on edit to make changes as well if there is something in the video you don't like that you want to edit this platform has an editor in-house that it can use to fix your video as well when you click on edit it's going to open up this page where you can start to work on your video directly instead of downloading it taking to another platform like Capcom and doing all the edits you can edit everything right here. now the focal video editing interface or timeline kind of looks very similar to what you would see on say CapCut or Adobe Premiere Pro and it does like pretty much similar things you can move pictures um, voice clips or sound effects around on your timeline for example you can click and drag one item or even select a bunch of items and move them around all at once if you want to see what you've made so far just go to any of the spots on your timeline then click play and it will play the video for you you can also scroll left or right and zoom in or zoom out to see more or less of your video on the left hand side you'll find a bunch of tools as well one of the most useful tool is the create tab this is where you pretty much see everything that you've made so far like images audio the video clips and so much more below that there are four main buttons the first is the new scene where you can basically create new images then there is the new speech where you can add voiceovers or narrations as well then there is new sounds where you can add sound effects and so much more as well then there is new video to make a video to add a scene or a video just click on new scene or a new video then you'll be asked to type in a prompt which means to describe what you want the AI picture or video to look like after that just click on generate and your scene or video will be created automatically for if you, you want to animate any of the image that was made just pick the version that you like and click animate and it will turn the image into an animated one to add the image or video to your project then just click on it drag it into your timeline or wherever you want it to go and it's done you can also add speech or voiceover as well so if there is something you forgot to add to the original voiceover or something extra you want to include just click new speech then you'll need to type in a short script of whatever you want the voiceover to say then click generate and it's going to turn that script into a voiceover make sure to choose the same ai voice that you use for the rest of the video so it all sounds the same when the voiceover is ready then drag it into your timeline to too. add sound effects or background music click on new sound type in a prompt to describe what kind of sound you want like cheering crowd or gentle rain or whatever you choose right and also choose how long you want the sound to be as well then click generate the sound will be made for you without you doing anything. when it's done you can either drag the sound into your timeline or download it if you want to save it for another project 
and voila that's simply it there is also a toolbar right above the video as well that you can use to edit your video the first tool is called snip selected item you pretty much use this to cut your video for example if the video is too long and you want to cut it just move your mouse to where you want to cut click on the video and then press snip selected item it will cut the video right at that spot you can also delete any video or audio clip as well by selecting it and then clicking the delete button there is also a selection tool that lets you pick different parts of your video it has options like select select all and stretch as well which helps you to grab and move parts around there is also a play button as well so if you want to watch your video while you're editing so you see exactly what you're doing you just click on the play button and it's going to play the video on your timeline for you as well if you make any mistake you can use the undo button or press ctrl plus z or command plus z to go back if you change your mind you can also use the redo button to redo whatever you undid as use well use the zoom in and zoom out buttons as well to change how much of your timeline you want to see zoom in helps you to see smaller details while zoom out helps you to see the whole thing entire video all at once on your timeline you can also move around the timeline using a slider or a button at the bottom you can even stretch the timeline to make editing easier as well the speed option lets you to make clips play faster or slower as well you can use the double full screen feature to hide the extra stuff on your screen so that you can focus completely on your video and what's on your timeline now after doing all of these tweaks when you're happy with your video just click on export and save it or share it and that's it that's how i was able to easily create and edit this full ai generated video using nothing but focal rising from the sands of egypt the great pyramid of giza is the last surviving wonder of the ancient world originally standing at 146 meters it was the tallest man-made structure on earth for nearly 4,000 years. Overall, I think Foco is an amazing platform, especially if you're a content creator or someone who wants to make videos, want to make TV shows, want to make content, but you don't have the money, the fancy gear, the camera, and all of those things. Or maybe you are just someone who's camera shy or you're too busy to film yourself. It's the all-in-one tool or platform you need to turn your ideas into full scripts and also make high quality videos, add voiceovers, sound effects, and even edit everything all in one place and it only takes a few minutes to get started as well. so tell me in the comment section what you think about this tool and whether or not you're going to give it a try to create your next video as well thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye